Hey signers, welcome back to Learn How to Sign. Today, we're going to be learning signs about emotions. So to avoid getting frustrated, here are a few tips to help you. Sign with me. It will be so much easier if you practice the signs along with me. If you aren't clear about a sign, or if it's too fast, go back and watch it again, or even slow the video down. Oh, nice to meet. There are timestamps and chapter markers down below so you can find a specific word. Speaking of watching again, repetition is the key, especially for learning a new language. Go back and watch these videos again so you can fully retain this information. And don't forget about our website, which is a great resource when learning how to sign. Go to learnhowtosign.org. So all those tips aside, let's learn how to sign emotions in ASL. Before we begin these signs for feelings and emotions, you need to make sure that you're really using those non-manual signals, which are basically facial expressions. You're going to be showing the emotions of every single sign that you're doing. So, for instance, if you're doing happy, you need to look happy as you're signing it. But if you're scared, you need to show scared on your face. So let's learn how to sign these feelings and emotional signs. Good or well or good or well. Your hand is coming from your chin down to your non-dominant hand. Good or well, good or well. Bad, bad. It's the opposite of good, it just flips around. Bad, excited, excited. Your feeler fingers are moving up on your chest. Excited, bored. Bored. It's like you're so bored that you're picking your nose. Bored. Confused or confused. You're pointing to your head and showing that something's messed up. Confused. Confused. Embarrassed or embarrassed. You're showing that you're blushing or your face is becoming red. Embarrassed or embarrassed. Shy, shy. Your hand is on the side of your face, moving forward like you're being really shy. Shy. Happy, happy. Your hands are flat and they're on your chest, moving up. Happy. Sad, sad. Your hands are bringing your sadness down. Sad. Same old or the usual. You've got Y hand shapes going in circles. Same old or usual. So-so, so-so. Your hand is flipping back and forth. So-so. Fine, fine. Your five hand is coming right up to your chest. Fine. Broken hearted, broken hearted. You're showing the sign broken and twisted right over your heart. Broken hearted. Emotional. Emotional. It's E hands moving in a circular motion out from you. Emotional. Busy. Busy. Now, if you're really busy, you go to show you're really busy. Busy. Frustrated, frustrated. Your hand is coming up to the face like you're hitting a wall. Frustrated, mad or angry. Your hand is coming in showing how your face is mad or angry. Mad or angry. Nervous, nervous. It's just like your legs are shaking because you're so nervous, nervous. Nothing, nothing much. Your O hands are shaking back and forth. Nothing, nothing much. Sick, sick. When people get sick, it's typically with their head and their stomach. Sick, sleepy, sleepy. It's like your head is nodding off. Sleepy, tired, tired. 
It's showing your body slumped over when you're tired. Tired. To be afraid or scared. Your hands are coming into your body like you're really scared of something. To be afraid or scared. Now that you've learned all of these signs, let's practice using them in sentences. When me, my mom, my sister get together, we are so talkative. Me, mom, sister, get together, talk, 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 talk. Today, I'm feeling really sad. Today, me, feel sad and make sure you're doing a sad face with that. Me. When we meet new people, my son is pretty shy. Meet new people, my son becomes shy. You look worried. Are you all right? You look worried. You all right? I am so nervous for the test tomorrow. Test tomorrow, me, nervous, me. Great job. Now remember, keep on practicing those facial expressions with your emotional signs. When you're practicing these signs, do them in front of a mirror so you can see your facial expression along with the sign. If you don't have anybody to practice with at home, get an app like Marco Polo, and that way you can send videos back and forth practicing your signs and your facial expression. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and be notified. And as always, keep learning how to sign.